hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in today i'm back with another video so today is the day before valentine's day and i have a little bit of appropriations left to do i was debating on getting something for kids or not because like i mentioned in the previous video we had um a little bit of a rough week a few days ago everybody was sick and so on so i was a little bit um lacking energy last week but today i think i'm going to do something small for the kids so i'm going to do a quick target run and see what they have left um i know target usually sells out of their holiday stuff and valentine's day stuff pretty fast so i'm going to go check it out what they have and maybe put together a small gift basket for the kids or something like this so if you want to see what i get and how all this preparation is going to go for us then please stay tuned so they have this cute little birdies i think i might just pick up one for each child because that's kind of a lost resort but they are cute and i remember kids like playing with different like stuffed birds animals one time when i saw them doing it I'm just gonna get three different ones and they're just five bucks so it's a little bit on the budget everything is pretty much gone I don't have even options for candy so I'm way too late with that hopefully I'll be able to find something that they like all the regular candies are still here so I decided to substitute I think I'm gonna get this Skittles Littles for each of the child I know Skittles are not good, but that's something that my kids really enjoy. And this pack is like $2.79. I would love to get a smaller bag, but they don't have it. So this is the Skittles I'm going to get for each of them. And, you know, hopefully they will like them so little as well. They're so tiny. Never tried those before. And I also got this um, game right here. That's, I think it's called Head Pains. I don't know. So I think that this is something we're going to try with the boys. I have this similar game on my phone to play with Preston when we were like waiting in line somewhere. But I think this is kind of cute. So you can put the picture of something and everybody guess what it is when you show it to them. Pretty cool. I don't know how doable it is with my um, very active kids. So we'll see. We'll try. It looks like fun. So I think I'm done with the shopping. I'm just getting them this little birdie. I'm going to make cards for them and also this pack of Skittles. I think that should be that should be it for this small Valentine's Day celebration for us. So I am back home. I'm about to start working on the cards. It's already 7 p.m. and I'm a little bit rushing because our bedtime is around 8. So I have one hour to work on something that I have in my head. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I picked up this cardstock. I already, I also picked up this craft glue and I already have this Cricut um, space or whatever it's called, the program for it. I think I have a little bit of an idea what I'm going to do. So I'm going to put it right here in the search, like a Valentine heart. And then I'm going to find something that's for free because all of those are a dollar. And I don't really want to pay for it right now. So I'm going to go ahead, press this view all. I don't use this program that often. So I'm a little bit slow with this whole thing. And I mark free. And it gives me all the free options that I really need. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do something simple like this. I'm going to make it a little bit bigger so I can fit more in one page. So... For example, something like this, about five and a half inches or so. And yeah, I'm going to ungroup it because I don't need that much design. I'm going to remove this heart in the middle. I think I'm going to remove this white right here. I'm going to make this one a little bit bigger. And yeah, I think that will be kind of a design. And each child is going to have like their own name on each card but that is the plan this way i will i will only need two colors for this card so this is how my design looking so far i'm going to fit it all in one 12 inch uh, page so this is going to be the back of the card this is going to be a front and then basically it's going to be red with a pink and then i'm going to make another card for aurora 
after this one so i think i'm going to cut it now see how that looks all right i think i'm gonna ready to start i'm gonna push it in my kids are going wild in the living room but it shouldn't take too long because it's pretty simple design so we'll see it's measuring it it's pretty cool to see how it's cutting i never really work with the cardstock it's usually like a vinyl but it's pretty cool and it does it pretty fast too we'll see how easy it is to uh weed out after this so that was actually very easy to take those out the it's only a little bit messy because it has all the dots left and then it already did this pink one so one is Cairo, Xavier, Preston, and Aurora. I decided to make one for Preston too. And I'm making some more of these red ones. Because, um, yeah, I need a little bit more of them. Because this will be like a front and back. So yeah, that is the plan. And I'm going to start assembling them in a minute as well. So this is how this first two turn out. It turned out not that great. I mean, this Cairo one looks good, but the Xavier is not perfect, but I think it's okay for the first time. It turns out that I forgot that these letters are going to be so separate. So I have to do manual labor here. So I'm going to finish it up and I'll show you my final result. So I think I'm done with this cars. It took me a little bit longer than I wanted, but this is the final result. I just put the sticks. Um... So I can kind of stick them somewhere. So this one for Xavier, it's not perfect. It looks very homemade. And I put these different little messages um, in the back. They're a little bit different for each of them. So this one is for Xavier. This one is for Cairo. It has this little message for him. Also, I got one for Aurora. And this one is for Preston. I don't have this uh, stick in there because I have a little bit of a different purpose for this card. Also for Preston, the other day I got this kind of chocolate. He likes Marvel and Avengers and all that jazz. I don't know how they called exactly. But I got this chocolate for him and I'm glad that I got it because it was gone today. So I'm going to get him this little card. And then I'm going to get him this candy and it's just like a little gift for him nothing super special but just something really cute so now it's eight o'clock i'm about to start putting kids to bed and after they fall asleep i'm going to assemble this little valentine's basket for them to wake up to in the morning so kids just went to bed i'm about to start assembling this little gift basket for tomorrow morning and then i'm gonna go to bed myself So this is how it turned out. I mean, I work with what I have. And this is my little budget-friendly Valentine's basket. And I just got some candy for the kids and a little toy and a little card. And each card has a little message in the back for them. So in my opinion, that's something nice to wake up to in the morning. So yeah, I'm excited to see their reaction. And that's about it for today's vlog. I am excited for Valentine's Day tomorrow. So I'm going to bed now. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you being a part of our channel and of our life. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoy watching videos like this. And I will see you in the next vlog. Bye!